Well, Halloween is tomorrow and people all across the U.S. will be out and about trick-or-treating. 22 News reporter Kiara Smith is live in the studio now working for you with some reminders on how to stay safe this Halloween. Kaylee, safety experts say parents may want to make sure that their child has a light or some type of reflective item on them so that they can be seen by cars on Halloween. It's that time of the year where trick-or-treaters will be scattering from house to house to get some treats for Halloween. But as exciting as this holiday can be, it can be dangerous if people do not take the proper safety precautions. The public information officer of the Chicopee Police Department says it's not only important for parents to make sure their children are visible on Halloween night, but it's also important that drivers drive with extra caution. Just have the parents, you know, give them a flashlight, have them put some kind of lights on their costumes so they're more visible from the cars coming down the roads. Uh, as far as the drivers, just be aware in you know heavy congested areas where the kids are going to be out trick-or-treating. Just kind of slow down, keep your eyes on the side of the road because the kids can be darting in and out from parked cars. He says drivers should also avoid being distracted and pay attention to their surroundings. Safety experts say trick-or-treaters should use the sidewalk and use crosswalks when crossing the street. And Odeon says it's also important that trick-or-treaters and their parents go through the candy before eating it to make sure it's safe to eat. When they get home with the candies, just have the parents check your candy to make sure it's all edible, make sure nothing's already been opened and put in the bags by mistake. And he says while trick-or-treating is fun for many children on Halloween, it needs to be done responsibly. Working for you live, Kiara Smith, 22 News.